Hello everyone, this is Sir Romel and welcome back to my channel. And today I will be your guide in taking up our new lesson in mathematics which is about integers, that is multiplying and dividing integers. Okay, so let's start with multiplication of integers. So for example, so I'm going to give you an example. I'm going to give you an example. Negative 5 times negative 5. Both are in closing parenthesis. Alam nyo na kung bakit, no? Negative 5 times negative 5. That is equal to positive 25. Why? Because ang rule natin, when you multiply negative number by a negative number, that is equals to positive numbers. Okay? So, let's say for example nga, negative 5 times negative 5. So, the answer is positive 25. Oh, halimbawa, example, another example, negative 3 times negative 4. So, the answer is positive 12. Okay? Okay, so that's the first rule, no? Negative times negative will give you positive number. Okay, next example. So, for the next example, we have negative 9 times positive 5. So, here, we're going to multiply negative by a positive number. So, what do you think is the answer? Okay, so the answer here is negative 45. Why negative 45? Rule number 2. So, if you are going to multiply negative number by a positive number, remember, the answer is negative. Okay? Positive times negative, that is negative. Okay, that's rule number 2. Okay, and the last example, we have positive 3 times positive 3. So, parang yung regular multiplication of whole numbers lang yan. Positive 3 times positive 3 is equals to, syempre, positive 9. Okay, third rule, syempre, if you are going to multiply positive by a positive number, the answer is a positive number. Okay? Okay, so again, balikan natin yung rule. So, rule number one. Ano nga rule number one? Very good. Which means, if we multiply negative by a negative number, the answer is positive. Very good. Okay, the next one. How about if you are going to multiply positive by a negative number or vice versa, negative by positive? Ano magiging sagot? What will be the sign? Okay, very good. The answer is negative. So, rule number two, again, multiplying positive by a negative number, the answer is negative. Okay? And for the third rule, yes, okay, multiplying positive number by a positive number, the answer is, of course, positive. Okay, so this time, let's have some exercises. Okay, uh, ready? If I flash ko sa screen yung, yung problem, and then I'm going to give you see, three seconds or maybe two seconds only, and then you give the answer. Right? Mentally or write it down in your scratch paper there. Okay, so let's start. Okay, oh, here we go. Okay, that is negative four times... 5. The answer is? Okay. Very good. So, the answer is negative 20. Okay. Next one. Negative 7 times negative 4. What do you think is the answer? 3 seconds. 1, 2, 3. The answer is? Very good. That is positive 28. Okay, and the next one. We have positive 4 times positive 9. The answer is... Very good. Positive 30. Okay. okay, so now let's proceed with the division of integers. Division na tayo. So... Actually, division tsaka multiplication, pareho lang talaga sila, no? If you're going to divide integers, kung anong rule sa multiplication, 
the same din sa uh, division. Okay? So, let's say for example, negative 10 divided by 2. Okay? Negative 10 divided by 2. So, negative by positive. The answer is, okay, the answer is negative 5. Why? Because sa division, the same as multiplication, when you divide negative by a positive, so the answer is negative. Okay, next one. Let's say, for example, 5 divided by 5 or positive 5 divided by 5. The answer is positive by positive. Okay, very good. The answer is positive 1. Okay, so yung rule number 2 natin, uh, rule number 3, we're in positive divided by positive, just like multiplication. The answer is a positive number. Okay. Next tayo. So, negative 9 divided by negative 3. What's the answer? Okay, very good. So, negative divided by negative. The answer is positive 3. So, the same sa nga sa multiplication. Ulitin ko, di ba? When you multiply negative times negative, the answer is positive. So, sa division, the same. You, move, you divide negative by a negative, the answer is positive. Okay. So, let's proceed. Let's have exercises para ganahan tayo. Okay. Oh. So, again, ipa-flash ko sa screen and then you're going to answer it mentally or you can write it down in your paper, on your paper. Okay. So, first one is, here we go. Negative 12 divided by negative 4. Okay, 3 seconds. 1, 2, and 3. Time's up. The answer is... Yes, very good. Positive 3. Okay, next one. So, negative 10 divided by 5. Negative 10 divided by positive 5. So, negative and positive. So, 1, 2, 3. Time is up. So, the answer is... Very good. The answer is negative 2. Next one. We have 42 divided by 7. So, both positive, no? For positive 42 divided by positive 7. And 1, 2, 3. So, the answer is, of course, positive 6. Okay, so for learning task 1, we are going to multiply the following and then you are going to write your answer in your notebook. Now, for those who are not around, yung mga absent, wala ngayon, or hindi nila mapapanood tong video, siguro kindly, uh, siguro send them message na yung mga exercises na sasagutin nila is pwede nila uh, isulat na lang sa papel at yun ang yung sasubmit sa retrieval by Friday. Okay, so pakisabi na lang, basahin na lang yung WHLP uh, And then, yung mga meron naman tayong guides doon And then, masasagutan nila, pwede nila ako i-text Okay, or i-chat In case na meron silang hindi naintindihan Okay, so please, kindly uh, send them messages Okay, para hindi sila naiiwan Okay, so let's proceed with learning task 1 So we're going to answer this Okay, I'm going to give you how many? Five seconds for per number. Okay, let's proceed. Number one, four times negative three. And then number two is six times six. Number four is negative four times negative five. And then eight times negative two. And the last one is negative seven times negative three. So I'm going to give you one minute, siguro, kasha na, no? One minute, go!
Okay, so pwede na. Answer for number one is... Okay, very good. That's negative 12. Next, number two. The answer is... Very good. That is positive 36. Number three. Okay, that's positive 20. Number four. Very good. That's negative 16. And number five. That is positive 21. Very good. Okay, so we got five correct answer. Outstanding. Very good. Very good. Okay, so let's proceed to learning task 2, which is about dividing integers. Okay? So, ito. Tignan natin. So, number 1, that is 8 divided by 4. Number 2, that is negative 12 divided by negative 3. Number 3 is negative 10 divided by 2. Number 4, 12 divided by negative 6. And then number 5 is 24 divided by negative 8. Okay. So, we are going to match column A with column B. Okay, write the letter of the correct answer. Okay, let's proceed. I'm going to give you one minute again for you to answer. Okay, go. Let's choose the letter. So, ready na? Okay, so let's answer. So, number one, that is 8 divided by 4. The answer is... Okay, letter B. Next, number two. The answer is letter E. Nice. Next, number three. The answer is letter... A, yes, letter A. And next, for number 4, the answer is letter D. And last one, number 5, for answer is letter C. Okay, who got 5? Correct answer. Very good. Very good. Good job. Okay, so for learning task 3, I'm going to ask you to evaluate the following expression and then you're going to write this answer in your answer sheets. Okay, so that is 1 to 10. Okay, so any questions? If you have any questions, uh, just text me or chat me or you can call me. Okay, so uh, this is the end of the lesson. And keep safe, everyone.